The U.S. VI Attorney General reaches a settlement with Honda. The dealer will provide the VI government with 50 new Honda vehicles and a payment of more than $1 million. The 2016 civil lawsuit all stems from these Takata airbags installed in Honda vehicles. The VI argued Honda violated consumer protection laws by engaging in the manufacturing, marketing and sale of the dangerous airbags. They were recalled because the airbags could violently explode, sending shrapnel through vehicles. They actually caused severe injuries and more than 20 deaths worldwide. One VI resident was gravely injured when the Takata airbag ruptured while she was driving with her children on St. Croix. Well, Attorney General Denise George announced through an out-of-court settlement, Honda agreed to provide 50 new Hondas valued at more than $2.1 million and a payment of over $1 million to the VI government. Now, some of those vehicles have already arrived in the VI and will be used in the government's fleet of vehicles. It was the largest recall in automotive history back in 2016, involving more than 40 million vehicles. A.G. George says high humidity can cause the airbags to explode easier, so any consumers should call their car dealers to determine whether their vehicle may still be subject to a recall of those Takata airbags.